Hello everyone. Today I'm here with a project share and this is going to be a friend mail and this is going out to a very special lady. Her name is Paula Hatton Vines who is married to Larry Vines and I wanted to send her something special so I made her a jean pocket and it's in the shabby chic style and this is the front. It's very pretty you can see the jean pocket in the background that's the blue color and then I put um, some lace here nice big sheet of lace and it also has some right um, sequence in there and then I put another type of applique it's this pink section here with a rhinestone center and then this part was a trim that I'd gotten I cut it apart and placed each one of the flowers on there and then I put a little plastic um, button I cut the back of the button off and put that inside the flower and then I put um, uh, the fringe the white fringe and then this fringe is off of a scarf and I left it shabby now you can go ahead and iron these I've done them like that just iron it and it'll become smooth but I kind of like it like this so and then I put a layer of beads and each fringe or beads goes on both sides of the pocket so you'll have a nice fullness to the purse so this is the front and then this is the back and these are embroidered appliques that I purchased and I cut them out. Aren't those adorable? They're just gorgeous. And um, now Larry makes these on the machine. So check him out. And then I put this trim on, very pretty trim. And of course, here's the beads on this side. Pink and green beads. And then the scarf also, and then the fringe. So this is the pock, uh, the jean pocket. Now you can't really see all of it, but I'll put a picture up. I've also put the handle on, and I've filled the back with a couple of goodies. I put some uh, extra my leftovers in here, and uh, this is the inside. I don't get real fancy on the inside, but I put a little trim, and I put the lace on the fold it over and just to finish off the edges on both sides but you can see the pocket in there so that's this pocket and then I'm going to send her a Christmas ornament that I've gotten ready I'm going to be sending out my ornaments as I send out happy mail because I want to get them out before Christmas. So here's the ornament that I'm going to send her. I've got it standing on a an ornament. Um, just a little ornament thingy. And so I've sh I think I've showed you this one before. I put some bling and some glitter at the top. This is a three roll rhinestone cup chain and some flowers and this is a, a real pretty scenery uh, I believe it's a church and a row of pretty flowers trim and then the trim I glittered the inside of the ornament and then the, the, the beaded trim I made myself I love that beaded trim and then on the back take this off it's just a plain so you can see the glitter real nice isn't that pretty so I hope you like this Paula and um, I'm not going to post this video until she receives her package because I don't want her peeking <laughs> Paula I hope you get better real soon we're all thinking about you and we have you in our prayers so you take care and Lots of love and lots of hugs coming your way. Talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.